But this is a team that if they get hot at the right time, they have the defensive mindset to really cause problems. Boy, oh, that's step back three. Sprained his ankle badly, according to Richard Patino, two days ago. He didn't do shoot around the practice earlier today before the game at all. He's going to try and give it a go today. So the leads the league in attempts from behind the arc, and they're dead last in three-point percentage. Uh, you just don't see that too often, a team that really struggles from three. Car. Oh, and all goodness. kinds of traffic. How does he get that shot through that traffic and gets it to fall? Entry, Hera tipped away. Good hands underneath by Curry. Push ahead to Williams. Williams driving to the rim. Count the bucket and a foul. Penn State's got a two and a half minute scoring drought, so the defense is picked up for the Gophers. And it's Curry again providing the defense. Carr accelerating to the other end with a three on one. There's Williams once more with the finish. Come at, come at you, come downhill. And, you know, they've been on the backside of some of these lopsided leads here, Kevin. But Jamari Wheeler is a much improved three point shooter over his career. I think mainly because he takes quality shots. Enan has the answer from the corner. Well, Mashburn Jr., who has not scored 0 for 7 from the floor tonight. Boost Gotch in the corner. That three falls. Good ball movement by Minnesota to find the open man. Here's Carr into the paint. Banks it home. Marcus Carr with 19. It was 24 the lead for Penn State with 13.54 to go. Down to 13 now. With 4.04 to go and a takeaway on the inbound. Really cool for guys like Trent Buttrick, who ties his career high on senior night. Double-double for John Hara on senior night.